Hey guys, it's your girl Jade. Um, this movie Madness I am doing is... <coughs> Ugh. It's a movie called Perfect Sisters. 2014 drama slash crime. Uh, it's an hour and 41 minutes long. Uh, IMDb gave it 5.6 out of 10. Rotten Tomatoes gave it 27%. And Metacritic gave it a 44%. Um, weary of dealing with their mother's alcoholism and a string of abusive boyfriends, teenage siblings plot to kill her. Um, it's based on the class project How to Kill a Mother by Bob Mitchell. Um, director is Stanley Brooks. Um, Georgie Henley plays Beth Anderson. And if you don't know, Georgie Henley played... Um, the little, the little sister, um, crap, I forget her name, in, uh, Narnia. Uh, Abigail Breslin plays Sandra Anderson, or Sandra, I forget how they pronounce it in the movie. Mira Sorvino, Sorvino plays Linda, the perfect mother. Uh, James Russo, Steve Bowman, Fab Filippo, Ashley's lawyer. I don't remember who. Oh, Ashley. I think I remember who she was. I'm not sure. Jeffrey Ballard plays Justin. Zoe Belkin plays Ashley. Rusty Schwimmer, Aunt Martha. Stephen James Donnie. Spencer Breslin, Cousin Derek. Zach Santiago, Santiago plays Detective Santiago. Uh, Jonathan Malin plays David. Rachel Henley. Home movie... Something. And you have uh, Sarah Constable, John Palemeyer, Marina Stevenson, something. Um, but anyway, these two sisters um, have been going through their mom being an alcoholic and her getting with the wrong kind of guy and then being abused, I think, every, every kind of way. Um... And they come up with the perfect plot to kill her. Now, in doing so, they also, they made basically a club at school of how to do it. So they had some friends with them that were helping plan this. Um, basically, they got sloppy and told people what they were going to do. And told them how they were going to do it. Now, if they had just done it with the two of them they probably could have gotten away with it. But because they let more people in on it, they didn't get away with it. So, but they are, they fantasize about how their mom would be perfect, like the kind of perfect mom that, that would be perfect for them. And they end up killing her by getting her drunk, I think drugging, the alcohol with some kind of pills, if I remember correctly. I haven't seen it in a while. And then they drown her. So, yeah. You know, I had all this stuff to say about this movie in my head, and I totally forgot it. Like, I've actually, I've watched this movie a couple of times. It is a pretty decent movie. Um, if you like that Lifetime channel type of movie. Because, um, you know, Lifetime is all about the abuse and, well, not like the abuse, but they show a lot of movies where um, people are getting abused and how they retaliate to the abuse and everything. Things like that, you know, the real tearjerker type stuff. So, yeah. So, I would say go ahead and watch this movie. It's not that bad of a movie. Um, I wouldn't let kids watch it, per se. Um, teenagers are okay, but uh, young children do not need to see it because, it because of the abuse that it does portray and everything. But other than that, anyone can really watch it. Just don't let your young children watch it. 
because you don't want to scar them like that too much. So yeah, that is my movie review of Perfect Sisters. It's an okay movie. So yeah, I need to come up with a rating scale of 1 out of 10 or 0 out of 10 eventually. But, whatever. Sorry, I'm playing with, like, this cord here. <laughs> Just because I forgot exactly what I was going to say about this movie. Like, I think this is my fourth review, so my brain is just starting to shut down. Yeah. But anyway, if you want me to review a movie, leave it down in the comments, and I will do my best to review it. And if you haven't already done so, hit that subscribe button. Um, and I will be putting out more re movie reviews because... I got a list of movies right here. On it, there are... No, 3, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20 movies. But some of them I'm going to do, like, for, like, the ones that have, like, sequels, trilogies, series. I'm going to do all those in one. So it's probably about, like, 15 movies that I still have on this list to do. And I don't know if I'm going to hit them all in one day, but I'm going to try. So probably by the end of this whole thing, my brain is going to be total mush. So yeah, bye guys. Love you. Deuces.